hello everyone welcome back to another mini tutorial today in this quick video I want to show you guys something really cool a way that you can find layers within your illustration really really fast so first I just want to show you guys how this is done and then I'll show you where you can access that option basically as you can see here I have an illustration of the globe very stylized illustration there's a hand kind of spinning it like a basketball so let's just say that I want to continue painting a certain layer in this case I want to continue painting the skin layer that we see here in the hand all that I have to do I just scrub the illustration here with my finger and I'm able to find that layer I'm even able to find the two layers that compose that section it could be the shadows that were just on top of the hand creating the shading and the flat surface as well now if I just go here and I paint on this layer once I go back into my layer uh, panel here you see that I'm actually painting in the layer that I actually wanted to so now let me show you another situation where this feature may come actually quite handy during the creation of this illustration, as you can see, there are a few layers here, maybe not as many as a very complex, uh, intricate uh, illustration, but it does have more layers, I would say at least more than five or even 10 layers. Let's just say that during the creation of this illustration, there's a few leftovers of those like annoying things that maybe you're just moving your hand around and by mistake or by accident, you end up having those leftovers uh, that you actually want to get rid of and you're you know sometimes you're here within other layers and you're going with your eraser brush and you're trying to find them and you can't really erase them and then many times what happens is that we're here turning layers on and off until we find this layer that contains all of these graphics well by having this feature once again all that you have to do is just skim through um, with your finger and you'll be able to find the layer that has these graphics and now you're able to just erase them very quickly so how do we access this feature well first you have to head on into the actions menu by clicking on the tools icon go into gesture controls and then select layer the layer select option and once you're here just choose your preferred method to uh, highlight that feature in my case I actually I am using the finger touch will invoke layer select I could be using for example the touch and hold or the touch uh, plus square or Apple pencil but what I like about the touch feature is that I am able to travel around the canvas and find the many layers that uh, are composing that image for example if I head back here just to controls and I turn on the touch and hold which is giving me a warning because I'm using touch and hold for my quick menu so in fact now quick menu is probably deactivated if I use touch and hold I won't be able to scan my drawing as you can see I can only touch and hold on that area so within all of these activation options I actually really like the touch and I'm going to leave quick menu touch and hold on so that's it for this video I hope you had some good educational value for you I hope you find that interesting and very um, informative and productive for you to put onto your own workflow if you did find this video helpful please leave a like subscribe to the channel if you're new and I'll see you guys on the next one. Ciao.